welcome back to Kawaii Toy Collector, and in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to make two ingredient Nogu paper slime. So yeah, also guys, the hashtag notification squad for my last video is... Also, remember, please leave a like and subscribe to Kawaii Toy Collector in the comments down below. Give us some video ideas, so let's get right into the video. Okay guys, so in today's video, I'll show you guys how to make two ingredient no glue toilet paper slime. So the ingredients you guys need to make the slime recipe today is any type of shampoo or soap. I'm using this one. You guys will of course need any type of toilet paper. You guys also need a bowler plate to make your slime in. And last but not least, you guys will need a mixing tool. Also guys, please don't mind my voice in today's video. I'm just getting over being sick. I've been sick two weeks in a row, so I'm trying to feel better, but I decided to film a YouTube video for you guys. So the first thing I'm going to do for this slime recipe is I'm going to add my soap into my bowl or plate. And I love this shampoo. I wish I got it in a bigger bottle to make more no glue slime, but this one will do. And that looks like just enough. And now I'm going to mix it for about a minute to two minutes just to get it super bubbly. So I'm going to do that now. That looks like just enough mixing and it got super, super bubbly as you can see. And this is what thickens up the soap to make actual Nogu slime. And now I'm going to get my toilet paper out and I'm going to get ripping it up just like this. I would suggest using a thinner toilet paper like this one I have, but any will do. And now for this recipe, all I'm going to do is I'm going to shred the toilet paper just like this. And I'm going to add it into the soap. And this is going to create almost like a butter Nogu slime recipe. Kind of like a fluffy no glue recipe too. And I'm just going to keep adding the toilet paper now. And now I'm just going to mix this up. And that's enough mixing. Now I have this really nice milky color. And the toilet paper is thoroughly mixed and there's a little bit of clumps in that. But that's okay. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this into the refrigerator for about two to three hours every 30 minutes i'm gonna mix it up make sure it's working if it needs more shampoo i'll add more shampoo if it looks like it needs more toilet paper add more toilet paper so i'll see you guys in about a second okay guys so it is a few hours later it's about two o'clock and here is the no glue slime recipe i actually added some white food coloring into here and here it is it looks super soapy still but look at all the toilet paper it got mixed in really nicely let me see if it's sticky oh yeah it's quite sticky as you can tell but look how cool this made for a nogu slime recipe it smells so good it smells like the shampoo but it's really sticky sorry if you hear any noises in the background my family's really loud but this nogu slime recipe is really really awesome i'm trying to mix all the toilet paper in here and i'm so happy i added a little bit of white food coloring into this just to make it more of like a buttery slime because whenever i think of fluffy slime i think of white fluffy slime because back in 2017 that's all i really made was white fluffy slime because i didn't have food coloring or anything <laughs> but here is a nogu slime recipe and this is a 10 out of 10 for me i'm so happy this turned out great it's probably one of the best no glue toilet paper slime recipes i've made in a while but yeah i really can't get over the texture on this it's so great and so fluffy and buttery this will melt after a few hours that happens with most no glue slime recipes because it's made from soap but this recipe turned out amazing you can also make this recipe with lotion i think i'm going to do another video on how to make no glue paper slime with lotion and toilet paper so if you guys want to see that please put it in the comments down below but this recipe was super super easy to make i'm so happy if you guys like this recipe remember to please comment down below if it worked for you if it didn't i will try to get back to you and show you guys some helpful ways on how to make this no glue slime recipe work but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video today. Remember to please leave a like and subscribe to Kawaii Collector in the comments down below. Give us some new ideas. Bye guys, I love you so much and peace. Remember, thumbs up for no glue slime recipes. I'm going to check out all my social medias. They will be linked down below. Love you guys so much and peace. Thumbs up for no glue slime recipes. Bye!